हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू आई सी यूनर्स यूट्यूब चैनल इंट्रा आयोटिक बेलून पंप आई ए बी पी इज मोस्ट ऑफ एन यूज इन द मैनेजमेंट ऑफ ए कंजेस्टिव हार्ट फेल्यूर बी कार्डियोजेनिक शॉक C. Pulmonary edema. D. Aortic insufficiency. And the answer is B. Cardiogenic shock. Intraaortic balloon pump (IABP) is most often used in the management of cardiogenic shock. Cardiogenic shock occurs if the heart suddenly cannot pump enough oxygen-rich blood to the body. The most common cause of cardiogenic shock is damage to the heart muscle from a severe heart attack. This damage prevents the heart's main pumping chamber, the left ventricle, from working well. The intraaortic balloon pump (IABP) is a mechanical device that increases myocardial oxygen perfusion and indirectly increases cardiac output through afterload reduction. It consists of a cylindrical polythene balloon that sits in the aorta, approximately two centimeters from the left subclavian artery. it helps your heart pump more blood what is the special area in the right atrium containing special nerves in which the regulation of systole can be maintained a sinoatrial node b atrioventricular node c atrioventricular bundle d purkinje fibers and the answer is a sinoatrial node sinoatrial node is the special area in the right atrium containing special nerves in which the regulation of systole can be maintained The sinoatrial node also called SA node is literally the pacemaker of the heart. It regulates heart rate through specialized conduction and first communicates to the atria causing them to contract and then communicates to the atrioventricular node which in turn communicates to the ventricles causing them to contract. Which emergency drug is used for the immediate management of SVT supraventricular tachycardia A injection atropine B injection nicorandil C injection adenosine D injection heparin and the answer is C injection adenosine The emergency drug which is used for the immediate management of SVT is injection adenosine Injection adenosine slows conduction time through the AV node can interrupt the reentry pathways through the AV node and can restore normal sinus rhythm in patients with paroxysmal supraventricular tachycardia psvt including 
PSVT associated with Wolf Parkinson White syndrome. What is dextrocardia? A. Heart situated in the right side. B. Heart situated below diaphragm. C. Heart situated above the sternum. D. Heart rate is abnormal. And the answer is A. Heart situated in the right side. Normally, the heart points towards the left side of the chest. But in a rare condition, the heart points towards the right side. And this rare condition is called as dextrocardia. Which of the following is not a risk factor of atherosclerosis? A. Obesity b smoking c stress d diet low in fat and the answer is d diet low in fat diet low in fat is not a risk factor of atherosclerosis Atherosclerosis is a disease of the arteries characterized by the deposition of fatty material on their inner walls. Hence, having a diet low in fat only decreases the risk of atherosclerosis. Which of the following is the complication of myocardial infraction? A. Heart failure B. Arrhythmias C. Cardiogenic shock D. All of the above And the answer is D. All of the above Heart failure, arrhythmias and cardiogenic shock are all the complications of myocardial infraction. After birth, which anatomical hole closes as to allow proper functioning of the lungs? A. Foramen oval B. Oblique oval C. Atrial oval D. Circumflex oval And the answer is A. Foramen oval Foramen oval is the anatomical hole which allows the proper functioning of the lungs after it closes. The foramen oval is an important structure in the fetal heart allowing blood to flow directly into the left atrium from the right atrium. Blood is directly bypassed due to the fact the lungs of the fetus do not breathe while in the womb and the blood is oxygenated by the maternal lungs. Therefore, it is not necessary for the blood of the fetus to divert to its own lungs via the right atrium. Instead, it goes directly to the left atrium. An inflammation of middle layer of heart is known as A. Endocarditis B. Myocarditis C. Pericarditis D. None of these and the answer is 
B. Myocarditis Inflammation of middle layer of heart is known as myocarditis. Myocarditis also known as inflammatory cardiomyopathy is inflammation of the heart muscle. A 54 year old female has collapsed at a shopping complex. She is unconscious and is not breathing. After ensuring that the scene is safe, you should next A. Open the airway B. Start chest compressions C. Insert an advanced airway D. Deliver rescue breaths And the answer is Thank you.